Dan's been the voice of reason here. We're going to enforce the blindfold. Hello and welcome to Anderton's TV. My name is Jack Duxbury. He is... D Bingers. And that is... Taylor. <laughs> <laughs> He's struggling with his name because he just recently got married. Congratulations. <laughs> Uh, nowhere near in sight for me. Dan, maybe? I don't know. But let's get to the point of this video. It's going to be probably entitled something like It's Felt Enough mm. or uh, Vanessa Feltz. Yep. I don't know. It, and essentially, one of the buzzwords in the sample world at the moment seems to be felt <coughs> pianos. I'm a sucker. I bought a few of them. Actually, I've got four felt pianos in my sample library, Daniel. Mm. And... Uh, this is just new territory for us. This is some stuff that we don't sell, but some people recommended this in the comments. Mm. And if there's any other blindfold videos that you think Dan should be subjected to, please let us know in the comments. Anyway, mm. so we've got four samples here. Your blindfold, can you see anything, Dan? No. No. But that's normally the case. <laughs> Mate, and uh, we're going to put headphones on Dan, so he's getting a very you know reference level. Mm. Um, I've checked nominally the volume of these pianos in here so they're all kind of peaking about the same but they're very dynamic forgive us what i want for you to do dan is mm. um here's your cans nice that's it you got them right that's the right way yeah. uh back the other way oh right the other there way. we go uh and i'm going to flick between them dan's just going to give us your reactions okay. as you're playing it and obviously you're going to have your own feelings and then maybe afterwards i'll get you to play the same thing Okay, this won't cool. be a very long video. Let's start listening to these things. Here is p piano number one. Okay, cool. It's lovely. It's like um, so much sort of sort of character and noise. It almost sounds yeah. It's, it's like it's got like a toy toy piano almost mm. style quality to it. Lovely. Oof. Beautiful. Gorgeous. It's lovely. Right, I'm going to move on to the next one. Quick one. Mm. I didn't explain what a felt, to me, the felt piano is. The, um, you might have had it on an upright piano. Often you can do the middle pe pe pedal down and then you kind of shift it over to the left. And that will bring in this felt that mutes the key. It was a practice mute. And that sound's become really popular. You've just got a grand piano, haven't you, Dan? Yeah, and I, I always leave the, um, the soft practice pedal on um, just because I, I adore the sound of this. It's one of my favourite channels. Oh, wicked. So, so we're in, yeah, and it's a, a sound that is so beautiful to play. Mm. And so all of these have some way, some form of kind of muting and felt preparation. Anyway, mm. next piano. It's absolutely ridiculous sounding, whatever that is. <laughs> it's, it's absolutely amazing. Um, oof, yeah, okay. We'll keep going. We'll we won't, keep I going. won't talk about comparisons or anything yet, but um, amazing to play that is. Oof. 
Beautiful. And just to point out as well, Dan is playing on the Roland A88 Mark II. We're going to do, probably next time Dan's in, a blindfold video where I'm going to get all the 88 key controllers out mm. for you and you're going to just play the same sample. Amazing. So maybe okay. we, we can remember which one's your favourite and we'll do that for the next video. Fantastic. Right, okay. uh, next piano coming right up. Nice as well. Mm, nice. Yeah. Ooh, Beautiful. One more to go, one yep. more to go. And this is the last one, piano four. Really nice. Okay, so we've we played those four in order. What was your gut feeling, Mo? Um. Okay, uh, my gut feeling was I believe it was the the, the, the second one, uh, which I've no idea what it is, had all the qualities. It like it had the most sort of convincing actual uh, piano feel, and then all the ornamentations just went really well with it. All the noise, the sort of you could hear the felt the best, the relationship between all of it, just it had all of the, um, the timbres to make it, you know, sort of the best one. To be honest with you, they were all really, really nice. And I think it's going to be make it easier to play the same thing on all of them, maybe to comparison. But I've got like an order in my head. I don't know what, it, what would you like me to do. What, how about like there, should I, what, these are the first patches that come up on mm. all of them. How about I kill the reverb mm -hmm. on there? Okay, yes. Uh, and uh, I'd imagine that some of you are probably going, I'll kill the reverb. But I do think that does set them apart. But So I'm going to go through and turn off the reverb on all of them, Daniel. Okay. Um, uh, just give me a second. This will probably be edited out. No worries. Went through all the plugins there and took out any reverb I could see and dropped any like ambience mic so we're we're going to try get the drier sound sorry if i've missed it if someone knows how to get it drier then uh that's good i'm just used to making things wet <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh right here we go let's go i'm going to mix these up in order now okay so we and you're going to know at home what he's playing so this will be um up to you to play now daniel bingham turned on by accident the reverb and delay at the end <laughs> sorry nice. but sounded gorgeous right so they know what that was let's go for the next one mate go for it 
I'll do the same thing. Okay. Beautiful player, mate. Okay, okay let's uh, next one. Last one. It's so good, I just realised. What? I just like, why the F have I put a blindfold on you? <laughs> oh, no, no. <laughs> like you can't you can't see anyway, because I go, I'm there. Do you wanna take the blindfold off? But it doesn't matter though, it doesn't Well you video. can't see the you can't see the Dan's being the voice of reason here, we're gonna enforce the blindfold because you play just as good anyway. Right? So one last playthrough sequentially piano one through to four okay uh here is do you want the original sound or the dry ones um well i'm just going to try and i'm just going to play very short amounts now to try and just we're going to skip now because i've just done that last bit so i'm just going to like okay go for it um just play one chord which one's the numbers that one number two go for it Okay, cool. Number three. Yep. Okay, cool. Four. Yep. Okay, cool. This is your only time. This is your only time. Um, okay, well, I'll give you an order, which is two, four, one, three, based on just that then. But two and four, are, there's three of them that are, there's two of them that are exceptional, which I think is like two and four. Um, obviously, it might be, it's hard when I play the longer pieces because I've more, for, that's why I wanted to do a like quick between the two, you know, so mm. that's my, that's my current order, which. Two, which, four, one, three. Which might go against Let's, what I said uh, earlier. Fist but, bump and get into it. Okay, results time. We've kept the identity of these pianos a secret from Dan and you up until now. And uh, in reverse order. So it's two... What? Two, four... One, three. One, three. Yeah, I that went, famous I, formation. Based on the, the third time round when I just did the chord, because obviously previously you play yeah. a little bit and you forget, but that's what I think. So it, it, in last place, mm. coming in was the native instruments, mm -hmm. noir felt. Okay. And that is, uh, if you don't know about- I actually have that. You yeah. actually have that, yeah. yeah. Oh, the, wicked. I've never use it, but um, yeah. But um, I didn't know that was that. Yeah, cool. And yeah. that, as I, from memory as well, is the Niels from prepared uh, piano, kind of yeah, Niels from endorsed yeah. pedal, uh, piano. It's 
149 pounds if you want to buy that so we both shelled out for that mm -hmm. respect yes. glad to know it's coming last Ah. <laughs> right, okay. Uh, yes. Yes. Right, and then in next place was piano number one, which was the Oliver Arnold's felt piano from the Composer Toolkit from Spitfire Audio. Mm. Now Oliver Arnold's is a awesome Icelandic composer, and he's you know convinced me to split with my money on mm. many occasion i've got his all his spitfire libraries and this one is uh comes in you can't buy the piano separately i don't think mm. but this is 249 pounds mm. uh it was really nice i mean it's it's the the last three were the ones where it was like god i mean i probably said i probably earlier on said something different than i said at the end it's one of those where depending on what you're playing and depending on the, the reverb being turned off, all those different factors, it was still amazing. Yeah, I don't think anyone, Taylor, I don't really think the same. They all were beautiful. Yeah, yeah, they were and, all. Uh, and you made you play slightly differently, yeah. the dynamics. Each one was, you know, they've probably all got, uh, you know, obviously not everybody's got enough money to buy all four, but um, yeah, they've probably all got their place. Cause, yeah. Thanks, mate, making feel better about it. <laughs> Right, okay, and then in second position was the, again, a Spitfire Audio product called the Cinematic Soft Piano. Mm. And that only came out very recently, and that's a real bargain at £29. What? Wow. No way. Right? Crazy. But hold your freaking horses, internet, and Dan, because your winner, mm. piano number two, Spitfire Audio labs soft piano how much free oof how mad is that yeah yeah it was nice wasn't it i'm not just going crazy it was taylor can you believe that yeah. <laughs> the whole time taylor's there going this one this one and i'm like yeah. there thinking oh my god what have i done was that I the was... same one as when i earlier on first said that was the it? one oh yeah every time yeah Okay then. And I have to, away from the piano, sat here. I don't know if it's coming through on YouTube, but. Mm. In the cans, it was just just quite, quite, oh, quite a bit in the and Can we just, I'm going to throw a little bit out, just to let you know, any one of you out there now, go onto the Spitfire Audio website, download whatever you have to do. There's a section of their website called Labs. And essentially, Labs is a series of free instruments that they do. Uh, they do really high end stuff. So obviously, I've, I've got a couple of their libraries here. They're great for strings, but the Labs community they developed, and that was the first ever Labs instrument. Wow. And a shout if you don't watch his channel, Christian Henson. <laughs> He's a hero of mine. And what the cinematic soft piano is, is the same piano mm. that he originally did for that one that's won. And, mm. he, and he took it down to Lyndhurst mm. and uh, kind of redid it very recently but it just shows you the magic of that original mm. sample that all the idiosyncrasies just make all of us feel something yeah and that's free that's madness i will be downloading that i do not yeah unreal madness so i think uh yeah i doth my cap to you christian henson i, I love it. and all the guys at spitfire because they're doing a great service for the world and if you don't have that if you're not used to it as well and you want really posh string libraries, they do a BBC Orchestra Oof. plug-in at the moment that's free. If you can wait for 14 days and you get every instrument of the orchestra, they're doing great things for people. And what a nice, what a nice way. That's, it's good mm. to know that sometimes you can save some money. Mm, beautiful. Uh, and what's a better price than freaking free, man? So would you do us the honour of playing us out? This is a free... So, soft piano by Spitfire Audio Daniel Bingham thank you for being here today if you like what we're doing consider subscribing if you don't let us know and if you want me to put Dan through any blindfold paces tell us what you think thank you brother mm -hmm.